just got news today. We got the phone call that he has made it to the way the, to the top of the wait list. And they called us with our initial intake appointment over Zoom for late August. So after waiting for about a year, that is some very good news. Yeah, it is. I'm thrilled about it. So, I mean, it's it's been a long time coming, but uh, yeah, they are. Um, the reason. I, I don't know the reason for waitlists at hospitals, but there's reasons waitlists are so long here in Ontario for uh, mental health services, especially to do with children and autism. Ho, 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 ho! That was close. The hell? Where is he? Oh, we almost got blown up. Close enough. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure some stuff out here. Rocket, you're fine. They've just gone to do some laundry, buddy. Relax. Relax. Sorry, the dog's freaking out. So we're going to put those in there for now. So, today we got to go over and get the remaining two um, Hey Nash, how are you doing? Thanks for the tab up. We're gonna get the heck out of here as quickly as we can because I don't know where the hell that creeper went to that tried to kill us. Oh, I forgot to turn down the volume on the TV so I'm hearing things in an echo. Just give me one quick sec. Hey Bildo, thanks for the lurk. So yeah, we've been uh, we've been busy missed yesterday. I created the river system and we started bringing villagers over. Ooh. I just suck at driving these boats. Hey, Llama, how are you? Just try to remember how far up this next river is. So, yeah, man, like I was saying, it's a good day today. I'm very appreciative for this place by us. It's called Grandview Kids. So, I'm very appreciative that it exists. Um, my oldest son went there uh, to see nutritionists when he was younger. Um, so, I know they're a very good place. And the people they have working for them are very 
good at handling children and they're very talented. I'm doing great. So, I have no worries that once everything gets started that uh, this will go fairly quickly. I think today we're going to try to build an iron farm. But we're going to need to find iron before we could build the iron farm. Simply because we need to build hoppers and we also need to find lava. There's a dog in the laundry room? Yeah. Oh. My wife was trying to do laundry and uh there's a dog in the laundry room apparently. Alright, all the way to the top. I think there is two left. Well we're here. Oh, there's another one right there. I think while we're here, we should probably... We're going to boat him up. And we're going to boat up the other guy while we're here so that uh, they're ready to go. Oh, boy. And once they're boated up, I think... Nope, I screwed that up. Once they're boated up, I think we're going to, uh... Try to take stuff from the village that will help us create... Our own little village near us once the breeder gets going. We'll open up this. We're gonna take the bucket, because we're gonna need more buckets as it is. Nothing in that house. Try to do this quickly, get all the houses raided. Oh, there's houses up there. Cause of course there's houses up there. Up we go. Okay, so we came all the way up here, and there's nothing up here that we need to take. Bless you. Since we're essentially going to make this village abandoned. Take everything we can take. I'd say we should probably take the uh, iron golem, but I don't think he's going to come with us, so. I'm going to get this guy off the top of the... Uh -oh. Oops. Yeah, he probably just kinda got hurt there. Dang it. In a well-lit area? Yeah, it looks like it. Get some 
get some sleep while we're over here so we're doing this in the daytime I didn't think we took that long but whatever Okay, let's try to get this guy off the mountain without hurting him. I usually like to go down the waterfall, but... There we go. I'm gonna... For Christ's sake. How did we get stuck on the... I'm gonna get both of these guys off the mountain. Whitewater rafting style. Well, shit. Oh, for Christ's sake. Guys, out of here. <sighs> Pain in the butt. This iron farm, once we get it up and running, better be friggin' worth it. I'm not even gonna fully put them in the house yet. I'm just gonna leave them in the. Hey, good catch, guys. gonna put these guys in where they should be and leave them there for now. So, we need iron to make the hoppers, and we're going to need to find a space that's at least 16 blocks away from any cave. We're going to need to find lava, which we need the bucket for. We need to go cut down some trees so we can make signs. We need our sheep to start, or to give us more wool. So we can make 10 beds. We need to breed up 10 villagers for this farm. We gotta lure a zombie down into a boat first. So, this iron farm is gonna take some preparation. But we have the initial start to it.
And we swim all the way back out, which is a pain in the ass. But, while we're running up there, I think we're going to kill sheep along the way to see how many, uh, how much wool we can actually get. Oops, shit, we're drowning. Logan, stop! Sorry, now my youngest is acting up. I'm slamming the bedroom door for some reason. So, we're gonna get some sheep. Hopefully we get another dog. Actually, might not be the time to get another dog because he's gonna have to follow us and we're gonna be in a boat. So. That might be a bad idea. I'm not saying it's completely a bad idea, but it's probably gonna be a bad idea. Two sheep. That's all we found. Two sheep. <laughs> two sheep for a total of two wool. Nice. I've never seen so little sheep in the Minecraft world before. Never seen so little sheep. Hey, there is that a sheep? I think it's a sheep. It is a sheep. Two sheep. All right. That's, at least that's a bed. At least one bed. We need ten of them. I'm going to have to see how much iron it takes to make, uh, what do you call it? Uh, I know what I'm trying to say here. Um, hoppers. Because I think I need at least three or four of them. The wood for the chest and the beds is easy. We live in a forest, so it's not like it's going to be hard to find wood for, you know, stone and all that. I know up uh, that there's lava on the surface, so getting the lava bucket ain't even isn't even going to be hard. Because um, we actually live near a lava uh, field as well. There's a uh, surface lava in this forest over here somewhere. So, I mean, we'll find it. It's not that hard to find. Um, so, pretty much, we have everything we need to have. Uh, I need to make, I need to find gravel because I need to make a ton of, uh, or ten occupations for them as well because um, it takes occupations to keep them still uh, and productive so they have a place to sleep and a place to work um, now they should be adults before going into this thing because apparently breeding them in there isn't an option because the children villagers are so small that if you breed them in there you can uh, they can walk into where the zombie is and the zombie kills them so 
um, they have to be fully grown before they go in there. So this is going to take some time. I mean, we got a good start to it. Get out of the water. Go, 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 go. Get out of the damn water, dude. You jackass. Okay. Zombies are officially assholes. Are they spawning cats over here? Because I hear cats. They are spawning cats over here. Stop, kitty. I got fish. Don't run off. in there for now. The boats have to go upstairs. Oh, man. The bucket has to go upstairs. So, I mean, we might even have enough wool to do raw cod. There we go. We're gonna get these cats. Another brilliant thing about having villagers over here. I, I'm not too upset about losing that one damn villager. I mean, it's only one villager. I mean, it's a piss off because I got him all the way here, then he died. But. What happened? Excess bows are going to go in there. <sighs> Bow. We're going to use that bow to fix that bow. I don't know why I put that in there. I want to get the bucket of lava to start off with so we have it. I'm going to bring the shears with me as well. We got the cod to catch the kittens. Oh, welcome to the channel, Jay. Thanks for the follow. See, we got our dog. So we're going to go. I need to get. I uh, got to get two more dirt so we can fix up that dirt uh, where we brought the villagers in through the river. Actually, you know what? I want to stop the river from happening in where the villagers are because we've got them in there, and that's all that was supposed to serve the purpose for. So we're gonna go. We're gonna fix that now. And while we're over, oops, yeah, damn it all, oh, yep, oh, I mean, I gotta come out here and plant the, uh, plant the other stuff anyways. And as it stands, I mean... Stop running away from me.
Oh, look at that! We got a rare achievement. We unlocked a plethora of cats. There's another cat out here somewhere, too, that we can get. while I'm here. Anybody out here eat? Nope. Oh, somebody just ate something. Oh, it's the yellow sheep. Alright. Let's see if we have enough for ten beds. I also got to see if I got enough to fix up the rest of that thing. Alright, guys. Hey, sit. There's another cat out there somewhere that we got to go get. Uh, meat root we got to fix up. We got the bucket on us. So we should probably do that first before we go get the lava. Where? Fix up that thing where I screwed up the... Uh, I don't know why I'm bringing the actual beetroot. <sighs> Damn it. Yeah, I put it in the wrong... F I'm having issues today. <laughs> yes, cat, you stay there. We have other stuff to do. I gotta find this other cat. Where'd this cat go? <sighs> I'm going to stop jumping on things that don't need me to be jumping on them. That's that's the main goal. And we'll make this look pretty afterwards. Like, not pretty as in pretty pretty, but, you know, pretty enough. Alright, so... Did I screw up with how much I built this out at? Just enough. One, two, three, four, dig. Get out of the water. Damn it. <laughs> so, from that one village, we got our carrots, we got our potatoes, we got our beetroot. Yes, I do appreciate you coming and hanging out, man. It is so appreciated. I'm going to need this dirt. I'm going to put this other stuff away. Um, and that goes in there. And that can come in there. Uh, I don't remember how much we have. We're just going to bring a whole thing of dirt with us. It's just, damn it, easier that way. 
All right, guys, if you can give me a quick sec, I got to run to the washroom. I'll be right back. Thanks for giving me some time. Alright, I am back. Thank you very much for waiting. And it's getting dark. Damn it. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, how dark actually is it? It's still sunny enough. And I forgot to bring the stuff to finish off the garden. Oh well. At least we can get in here and... Get the river blocked up. River blocked up. There we go. So, we're going to try and breed these guys eventually. So, we need to make some bread. I think I already made the bread. We just gotta bring it with us. I'll, uh, throw each of them as much bread as they can carry. Let them start breeding in there.
because we've got to see if we got enough elements first to make this thing. Now it's not going to be some fancy pretty iron farm, it's going to be an underground f iron farm about seven blocks deep from the surface. Uh, the heck do I need? Uh, How many fletching tables can we make? 13. We only need 10. So there's a good start. Cool. So we got the fletching tables. There's a spider right outside the window. Okay. So that's four beds. I think it's only three wool. That's nine beds. That's ten. Well, we got the ten beds too. So, so far so good. It looks like we're just going to need the villagers for this. The ten adult villagers. And while we're here, we'll make the boat that we need for the zombie to sit in. One, actually, no, we're gonna put the beds in the and the uh, boat in with the wool, just to keep it coordinated. I think we also need five signs. Do we have enough to make signs? Probably if we had some sticks. Signs. One. All right. So... We've almost got all the components, I just gotta go find the lava again. The lava should be... I wanna put this... I wanna try to not carry as much stuff as I can humanly possibly can on me. Just simply because... That usually ends up bad for us. I've died quite a few times on this world already. We, uh... Don't want to die... No. We'll put some of the, the hay in the other building, too. <sighs> Those chickens are so loud. There we go. I 
forgot to bring the bread for the villagers, because of course I did. Guys, I'll get there. I'll remember all this stuff that I need to remember eventually. I know I made bread. Where the hell is it? Ah, uh, there it is. We'll just start with four apiece. It should be good enough for them. <sighs> and a wooden slab, because yes. So, I made all these um, railway tracks thinking that I was going to bring the villagers over here by railway track. And uh, we ended up using the boat method, and whoops. Now I've got a bunch of railway tracks. It's working. I'm gonna have a villager soon. Yes. Let's go get the bucket of lava. Then we need to go find. Um. Uh, what do you call it? Iron. Man, I'm struggling today with talking. Talking is hard. So, I'm gonna run up here. I know there's lava in the ground somewhere. We just gotta find it. Because there's an, uh... Well, it's level with the ground, but I guess they consider it an underground lava source, so we just gotta look for the cobblestone on the ground. And I know it's up in this direction. That'll make the bucket of lava fairly easy for us to get. Oh my god. I apologize, guys. Rocket, come on, bud. I apologize for this. Okay, so we got... I think it's past this. I think it's down in here somewhere. I know, I've, I've walked past it like 15 times already. Uh, watch, now will be the time that I can't find the damn thing. Okay. Cow. So, I'm going to backtrack here a little bit. Just, I think I know where it is from this area. You're my friend. Thank you. So, this is where we were coming to scout out the whole situation with the, th with the uh, villagers. And then I'd run this way. So, sorry about this. Uh, this is generally how I find things. Usually smart people mark down coordinates. I wander and backtrack a lot. Not paying attention to my health or my food consumption. Uh, Rocky, don't get closer, okay? Logan, can you calm down, please? Did I say, Rocky, don't get closer? Yeah, that's fine. I want you to calm down, please. I don't know, baby. Okay, you be right back. Ugh. Okay. Maybe 
maybe it's a little further down. I can't remember, man. Ah, <laughs> uh, dang it. I know it's around here somewhere. <laughs> if that's any consolation to anything. I know it's not as far as the mountain beside us. So, if we hit going up the mountain, we've gone too far. And, like, right now, we're, like, right at the base of it. And it's, like, right at surface. It should be around here. I'm not understanding this at all. Oh, no, hey, listen, 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 don't kill the sheep. Stop killing the sheep! I'm trying to tame your ass so you're not killing sheep. It's a madhouse today in here. There's... Is that my... I don't think that's my... Uh, oh, Jesus. Don't blow up my dog. Ah, bonus. We found it. Nice. Don't fall in, please. That dog came very close to falling in the... the lava. Let's get the heck out of here, because this is like Creeper Central. And I don't want my animals being blown up. Like that! Jesus. Okay, so we've almost got all the components except for the iron for making the hoppers. Once we get the iron... Get out of here with that explosive crap. Once we get the iron, we'll be fine. I want to start lighting this area up more so nothing can spawn in where we live. This is becoming ridiculous, the amount of stuff that spawns in this area. There you go. We have dogs. If we can just get another cat, we'll have cats. I know, most people usually decorate their houses and stuff. I, um... more worried about getting the world up and running and started before decorating the house. Alright, so our bucket of lava is going to go in here. Bucket of lava done. What's going on, dude? I am trying to make
make a villager breeder right now. I gotta go find some iron. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to see how much it costs to make a hopper. I need to make four of them, so... Six iron and one chest per hopper. Yeah, that's all good. Found the mine carts. Hmm? Oh, not the breeder. I meant iron farm. I want the iron. I need an iron for an iron farm. I've got the... I've got the villager breeder already. And brought the villagers over to it. I'm trying to find... Holy crap, I can't find the hoppers. Why? Is it like dis... Yeah, and it need to be needs to be sixteen away from a cave or something so that the <sighs> creeper or the the iron golems don't spawn in the cave instead. There's the observer. There's the hopper. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's five iron and one chest, so five iron, eight wood. It's okay, I'm just trying to save this last cat here before I go try to find iron. Yeah, I, that's the last thing I need to start building this up is the actual... There was a kitten that was out here, and now I can't find the damn kitten. Oh, for Christ's sake. There's four spawn creepers. Yeah, I've got spider spawners already that I've found. I just need to find... Oh, not with spawners. Okay, no, then I don't know. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Well, yeah, because you can make TNT from them, can't you? Yes. Yes. I don't even know where the desert would be in my world. I haven't found it yet. Which sucks, because I want a camel. And the only place you can get a camel is outside the... Uh, or around the... Yeah, they're around the well in desert villages. So you got to find yourself a desert village so that you can find the well. Yeah, they're around the well inside the desert village. And that's the only place you can get a camel. One camel per one well inside one desert village. Yeah, because they all, you can also have ancient debris in them now. 
So, uh, or not ancient debris. What is it called? Uh, you know the, the uh, tales and trails, the archaeology stuff. Yes. God damn. damn mountain to level 120 and I gotta dig into it to see if I can find iron without falling this time would be great Or, you know, just keep falling. That's, that's all good. I don't need legs or knees. I hate climbing friggin' mountains, and they put iron most prevalent at one fucking 20 in the, in the world. So, the best place to find iron is up a damn mountain. So you gotta climb mountains to get iron. Well, get iron fast, anyways. Baby llama. Baby cow. Okay, I'm at 122 right now. Alright, here's what we're digging in. I'm gonna clear cut this damn thing. Good boy, buddy. I know there's a way you can make, like, a diamond farm, too. You find, like, a, uh, what is it, a vein of, like, four diamonds you cut in behind it and put, like, what, what's that thing called, a piston behind it? And the piston just keeps hitting the diamond for some reason. Look it up on YouTube. It's, like, some type of glitch. And every time the pit... Well, this this uh, this iron farm I found works in bedrock. The guy was building it in bedrock. I found it on TikTok. I'm 
No, I mean, if I had Fortune 3, I wouldn't care, but I don't have Fortune 3 on any of my pickaxes yet. I can't even find Lapis, for Christ's sake. Yeah, you get villagers. Build a house out of diamonds. Diamonds. Diamond blocks, diamond steps. No. Oh yeah, well now it's different. Now you need the netherite template. But yeah, I know how to farm netherite. Yep. I don't think, well, you use TNT to farm the nether, you can use TNT to farm the netherite, because TNT doesn't blow up netherite, right? Or ancient debris, sorry. I'd really like to find some iron in here because right now I'm just blowing through my pickaxe, just smashing rock for no good reason. Iron! Yay! Hello? Everyone there? Nice. How much was that? Eleven. So it's five per hopper. I need four hoppers. So I need... Twenty. So I only need nine more. Logan, calm down. Creeper, or creeper, stupid friggin' zombie. That iron, iron and coal. Yes, buddy. Why do you hit... Hmm. Yeah, 
buddy. keep finding coal too because I do have mending on this pickaxe I believe yeah so I need to keep finding some coal so I can keep mending the pickaxe up Fine, buddy. Yeah, I'm not pulling dirt out. I don't care about looking under the dirt. Oh, I've already got everything to build this stupid iron farm. I just need to find a spot to set it up at. Should be enough to build the hoppers. Yeah, right, let's head back. <coughs> And let's get out of here. Get to the top of the mountain so I can see which direction I have to head and we'll uh, head home. down the mountain trying not to hurt yourself. Smelt the iron, breed the villagers, because we need ten of them, plus we need two to stay in the breeder, so well, we're at five right now, I 
think so. We need another seven villagers to be bred and to grow up. So, because this, like I said, this iron farm does not work unless the villagers are all fully grown. Because with the zombie sitting in the middle in the boat, if you've got a baby villager, he can wander underneath and get smacked by the zombies. So. Yeah, so we got to make sure these villagers are breeding and that they're growing up. I just got so much cobblestone just by digging out like that whole level of that mountain. Find a spot where we can go seven deep and I make a seven by seven. Oh wait, I wanted to bring more bread so we can give it to the villagers. That's right. Excuse me. Ice cream truck is here. Speaking of bread, we should see what these villagers want for trades. See if I can empty out my food storage bin a little bit of some of the produce. Yeah, good try, little one. He wants actually he actually wants bread and potatoes. He wants wheat and bread. He wants potatoes. So we have potatoes. We can do the potato one. We can do pumpkins. Okay. Can you guys like not stand near the gate? he want? Huh? Sticks. Oh, we can get sticks. That's easy.
spider somewhere in here. Now we want it to be on flat land with what they're doing. So we're going to have to make a flat land all the way over to the farm. Which game? Oh. Alright, so I think I found... How oh, most games like that are, I find. So, we got our... Back up and go in the house, man. What the heck are you doing trying to get out the door? Let me get a friggin' boat and sit you in it. Stupid villager. Baby villager just sitting, like, right at the gate. Like, I'm gonna open it and let him out or something. And we will worry about making money later. I want to find the rest of these cats. And there was another cat out here somewhere. I don't know where he went. It kind of pisses me off. get any trees we find out of the way as well, just because trees make it hard to transport villagers in a boat.
so this is where they're going to come across at. Oh my god, I'm going to get stuck on a piece of bamboo. <sighs> and a tree. I'm going to make this all one level, because we need seven, right? seven by seven that we're going to cover over. One, two. Thanks. I'm just trying to do some work here. Seven that way. Two, three, four, five, six, seven this way. Okay. So again, how far? Working. Fuck off. Stupid fucking zombies. You know what? We'll just come back because now there's a skeleton that wants to get involved. <sighs> All right. Will you go to bed? Stupid friggin' kid just sitting out here, staring at the fence, gonna get shot by the stupid skeleton. Wait, how did he get out? something man just trying to build something I forgot to an axe. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. You sound like you got a cold. Ah. Uh. Have the barrier. We should be good because, as far as I know, there's no caves in this jungle. I think I've put it far enough away from the breeder and the house and the barn and the stable that they shouldn't interfere. Famous last words. But we will see. And now we gotta go seven deep.
That's two. Three, four, five, six. Nice. We are seven deep. We're just going to pull this coal at the bottom of this. So we're going to go back up to the floor. Just because it's coal and, well, we need it. Again, enough. Now, once we get this dug out, hey, I found lapis in the freaking hole. Nice. One second, guys, I gotta go on mute for a second. So yes, this is going to be the underground iron farm. Apparently this is one of the most simple builds you can use. And it works apparently on both Java and Bedrock. Now I'm taking this from a TikTok, so if you want it I don't even know if I can link the, the guy's name in the description, but I will try to. Or you can just follow the, the design that I'm using. And since the video, or it's going to be in a video on YouTube, you can go to my YouTube and check it out as well. But I know you can't be sick within 16 blocks of anything else, including a cave, or you uh, run the risk of having... The, uh, th 
things spawn in in the cave, the iron golems, so keep that in mind when you're building this. You want to look around for a spot where you know there's no caves. You're going to build stairs like this so that you can get up and down easily enough. Guys, we're going to need to lure a creeper into a boat in the middle of this, and that's the next step. So we're going to have to stay up tonight. A creeper. Zombie. Not a creeper. You'll blow your freaking thing sky high. So, what we're going to do is we're going to... Get an axe, and we're going to start cutting down. Because we need the dirt to come with us, so... Two axes. Start cutting down some trees. <clears throat> Get them out of our way. Of course, we start by cutting down a tree that's got like 80 million branches, because why the hell not? This is the first farm of many I'm planning to build. Once we get this farm up and running, we're going to try to get an automated carrot wheat and uh, our beetroot and uh, uh, potato farm up and running. Uh, we're also going to try to automate pumpkin melon and we're going to try to automate sugarcane as well as uh, what the hell's the other one? Uh, uh, I'm thinking of bamboo, I think, because I already said pumpkin and melon. Oh, we got zombies. Okay, we need a boat. We need a boat. We need a boat. Hey, 
Look at me. There you go. I just need one of you. Follow me. Follow me. That a boy. Come on. Just need one. Come on. Keep coming. Good. Who's a stupid zombie? Come on. One, two, three, four, one, two. Ah, excellent. Gotta love it when a plan comes together. Okay, can't get close to this guy, obviously. Damn straight, A team, all the way. from every edge. So... Hang on. I gotta watch the video to see how I did this, but as long as he's covered, he should be fine. Save video. Sorry, guys. Finding it. Should have had this prepared to go. Instead of sitting here with a uh, in a hole. One second, guys. by three of dirt when he's right in the dead center which means did I fuck this up I might have we might have to wait till the next night because I got to reposition this boat which means I'm gonna have to kill this zombie We gotta have the boat placed first. Shouldn't have tried to throw the boat underneath him. Because we need it too wide all the way around, so we're gonna want the boat to be here. My son is not listening at all. One, two, one, two, one, two, three. So that's not right in the middle. What the hell? Right in the middle, right in the middle. There we go. Actually, we might be able to do this now if we could find a damn zombie. Hopefully we have time to get one before the sun comes up. Because there should be one back here. Are they still running around this 
villager hut? Oh, for Christ's sake. Not going to have time now. It's just going so well. Hey, how's it going, Nova? How are you doing? Oh, drowning. I was doing great until that. I, I have a feeling I'm just trying to kill myself in this game so far. <laughs> just trying to find a zombie friend to follow us down into this boat down in the... Oh, come on. Stop trying to get me blown up. That's a boy. You follow me. I need you. You come with me. Come on. Come on before the sun comes up. Walk a little faster. This zombie needs to walk faster, man. He's going to not make it before the sun comes up. He's going to end up dying. Come on! For fuck's sake! Yeah, dude. I'll talk to you later. Main goal was to not friggin' die today. At least we can get all our stuff back. But the zombies are gone. Which is just great. And the sun's coming up. Come on, zombies. There's got to be one here. There's friggin' three of them. Sorry, that was instinct. Trying to save you. Okay, so now he needs a name tag. What should we name this guy? Anybody? I kind of want to name him Jackass, because this is... Apparently there's... What the hell's down there? That better not be a friggin' cave. Okay, so our name tags are upstairs. We've got to go upstairs to get a name tag. We're going to name this guy, I don't have a level on me right now either, great, that's just perfect. Um,
Gotta go get a, a level, gain a level quick. At least one level. Wait, we're cooking stuff down here, aren't we? Maybe that'll give us a level. Well, Oh yes, we need the chests. That's right. So we need five chests. We empty some of this stuff out, man. What do we have so much stuff in our inventory for? I know certain things and why they're here. Some of this stuff is just a, a pain in the butt. I need to keep skipping over. us with eight. Nice. So now we got our hoppers. Beds. Signs. Lava. Just need the chest. The chest and the, uh, what do you call them? The villagers. Get out of the tree. That tree's coming down next. And he despawned. For Christ's sake! Oh, we got the name tag at least. Guys, this is unbelievable. Never had this much problems building something in my entire life. Cool, thanks, Nash. I'm still here struggling. We just died again. <sighs> I think every t every day I play this game, I die at least once. And all I'm trying to do is just, you know, build. Make life a little easier for my guys. It does no good for us to have a zombie that is already half dead.
So what we're going to have to do... So we've got the boat placed, which is good. There we go. So everything's out of the damn way. We don't want stuff spawning here. I don't have that on me. Cool. All right. So we got all the components we need to build this iron farm. Let's go get some levels back so we can get a zombie. Actually, probably gonna have to sleep tonight so we don't have phantoms bugging us because we I think we've been awake now for three days So, yes, baby. Good job, buddy. So it's getting dark. So when it gets dark, I'm going to run inside and I'm going to sleep. It's starting to get dark now. I'm going to go put some of this stuff away because we left the door open for some reason. Not cool. Um, uh, yeah, I got more. Okay. Logan? Calm down. Sure, babe. Us, so that's good. 
so we're gonna go sleep and then I'm gonna run and get my last coffee and go to the washroom so if you guys can give me a second and wait I will be right back all right guys I'll be right back give me a sec I apologize. Sorry about that. I'm back. Time is it outside? Uh, 
So we got time to do a little bit more fishing. Up our level a wee bit. We're not going to worry about breeding any more villagers until we get this thing in place. So the boat's going to sit in there and we're going to fill the boat with a zombie and name him. That's our, and then cover him. That's our first process. Then we're going to put the beds down. And the, not just the beds, but the uh, occupations. starting to get dark we're gonna go out and put all this stuff away including the uh, fishing rod because we don't want the fishing rod on us when we go because it's got the curse of vanishing on it so we don't want to bring it with us because we have a bad habit of dying and we do not want to lose this fishing rod Slogan. Gets frustrating sometimes, guys. Like he can remember music and he can remember uh, stuff from the shows he watches, like no problem. But if you tell him something, he forgets it like ten seconds later, and you have to keep telling him and telling him and telling him and telling him, and, telling him and sometimes you just get frustrated. spots because over here we seem to get saddles and books I don't know why I built the dock in front of the house but over here you get more stuff so it is what it is pay some points saddle two casts in over here Another name tag to replace the name tag we're using on the iron farm. <laughs> Another name tag. I don't know what those were. I think those were boots.
We just got another book, so hopefully there's mending on it. And after this cast, we're going to head in and put stuff away. Alright, let's go. Stop crouching. Protection 4, Flame 1, Bane of Arthropods, Loyalty 3, Quick Charge, and it's more of a book for... A bow, but... saddles away this time because I think it's going to be a while before we actually get over to see where the damn horses and stuff are. Alright, here we go. Trying to lure a zombie. Night 3. our friend. <sighs> I hate creepers. We have Jagoff. Oops. What's wrong now? What? Logan, that doesn't help me. We're gonna need more beds. We're gonna need way more beds. I didn't bring enough beds. Off. 
Five more. So we want to fill all these up with beds. Okay, I gotta figure out what this guy did so that the zombie couldn't hit people off to the side. Okay, so what did he do? So we want four blocks like that so that the villagers can't get damaged. We've also got to bring in some... We need more beds and we need four slabs for each of the corners. Oh wait, we got the zombie, so instead of putting up with this crap, we're going to bring the slabs, and we're going to do the rest of this stuff during the damn day. Because why the hell are we going to put ourselves at risk? I apologize, guys. Now, he should still be out there. Yeah, you're not hiding in my thing. underground walkway I think. I'm really hoping we might have to dig down to it and find out what the hell's going on down there. Yes, Logan. Sorry, guys. Hi, Mrs. Bane Bane. I am building an iron farm. Very slowly, I might add. Because everything keeps piling up against me. That's not where that's supposed to go. There we go. So it will work when they're standing on here. They will lose sight of the zombie every now and then so that they can sleep. Okay. So now we need another wall. <coughs> because of the um, 
unfortunate creeper accident we just had. I'm going to have to bring more of our dirt to fix the thing up. And I'm going to have to take a break here in a second because somebody's starting to freak out and have a mild freak out. So I'm going to have to fix this issue. Because he's playing with other people. And I think because they probably recognize he's younger that uh, they're targeting him in the game. Which I don't like. But. Bud! 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 I forgot the piece of wall. Okay, but I want you to calm down, okay? If you don't... Logan, if you don't start calming down, Daddy's going to have to come over and we're going to have to have a hug. Is it hug time? Okay, as long as that's all you're doing. Okay? Promise? As you can see, I've been hard at work. I've made a villager breeder. Um, okay, is it hug time? Uh oh. That might have been a mistake. Okay, definitely a mistake. And there is a cave down here. Shit. This is what I was afraid of. Hopefully. This doesn't affect where our... Our creepers are going to spawn. Are our creepers... Why do I keep saying creepers? Our iron golems are going to spawn because they've got to be 16 blocks away from a cave. And I didn't know there was a cave that far under the ground. Because there's no entrance to it, which sucks. So it's right under here. We should be good because we're still way back over here. Are you okay now? Do you need daddy to come give hugs? Okay, guys, give me a second. I gotta go tend to this. <clears throat> Are you gonna be good now? I don't know. Are we gonna be good now? No. No? So we're not going to be good? Logan, enough, please. How many beds does that give us? Only 
25, huh? We're going to have to trim more sheep. Wait, I've still got wool right there. Why did it not give me a... We're probably still going to have to trim some sheep, but at least this will make it a little better. He's on the verge of having a breakdown, guys, so just give me a second if you will, if you can uh, in a bit. I'm uh, just monitoring the situation right now, but if he has a breakdown, I'm going to have to jump and uh, go try to calm him down. So, just trying to monitor the situation a little bit here. Hopefully, we don't have to do too much more sheep trimming. We do. We, we gotta do one. One more. Kinda wanna get this zombie covered up, so all we have to do is, uh... <clears throat> make a uh, so we can make the platform over top of them where we can dig in the corner and so yeah you gotta make the heads of the beds face the zombie so that the, cre or the villagers get up away from where the zombie's at if the villagers get up with their feet facing the zombie it ends up that they can get in the zombie's path and they get hit and they die so you need to kind of turn it around so that, uh, you know what, we're just going to go trim our sheep. That should give us three things we need. And then we can focus on breeding the villagers. Shears are right there. Okay, good. Hey, Kayla. I'm hoping so too. I'm monitoring the situation. He's um, so far so good right now. Not enough for another bed. May as well finish trimming up. So we have our wool. The yellow guy is the pig out of the whole bunch because every time who just ate more? You did. So, yeah, I'm hoping he can get through without a breakdown as well, but keeping an eye on the situation, it uh, should be alright. Um, I mean, it's not ideal. I should put the hoppers and stuff back because I don't think, well actually, we could probably do everything except for the lava. So let's put the lava bucket back because I don't think we need the lava bucket yet. Because we're going to need water as well. Logs, come on now. Really? You 
logs. Come on, buddy. You're okay. You're okay. Can you come see Dad? All right, guys. Give me a quick second here. I'll be right back. for that. Sorry guys, I'm trying. Um, yeah. He's on that verge where it could happen at any second and uh, it, uh, it isn't going too good right now. Alright, so we got our beds placed down. I gotta figure out what the heck I do next. Did he put torches up? Okay, so he didn't put torches in. Why the hell didn't he put torches in? So we need to uh, fill this all the way in and then we need one right in the middle. So where's the middle? There's the middle. Kidding me? <sighs> Sorry, guys. So this is where the villager, or the the 
Iron Golem spawning platform is going to be. Now we do the chest. I'm assuming this is where we're going to build our staircase now. villagers down and up. Okay, so we've done that. So there's the hoppers and the chest. So we got to wait till we uh, breed enough villagers to get the next part going. So I'm going to leave that for now because we don't have enough villagers, but we do have enough now where we can get the villagers down here into the corner. We can now get our iron out when we want to get our iron out. So we're going to bring the villagers across here. We're just going to drop them down in there. We're going to put a hole so they can we can drop them into the thing. And we have an extra hopper. How many villagers do we have now? Stop it. Damn it. We have one, two... Three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Um, we've only got six beds. That's the problem. We need more beds in this area, too. All right, um, okay, we're not wasting all our, yeah, we are, we're going to waste all our fuel on this. Sorry, guys. 
we got six. So we we're technically got four. So we need six more beds because they need the. They need to have six more villagers. So that's one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Time to pump up this villager breeder to get us what we need. And when I'm done uh, putting the beds in the villager breeder, I'm going to have to sign off because he really needs our help. So. For the early departure. This is what a meltdown looks like, guys. And there we go. We have six. And I, unfortunately, I'm going to have to leave it here for the day. I'm going to have to... Uh, I'm going to send us over to somebody else's channel so that we can raid them. I do apologize. Um... I gotta take care of this freakout, as you guys can hear in the background. And this is a day in the life with autism. So just give me a quick sec here. Uh, I'm just trying to see who's on, who's on, who's on. We're going to go raid uh, Artisan K9. Go say hello to her. I got to go take care of this uh, freak out. So, like I said, I do appreciate you guys tuning in. I am sorry that uh, you guys had to hear what's going on in the background. I do apologize for it. Um, but if you're new to the channel, please do me a favor. Hit the follow button. Also do me a huge solid. Check out my new videos over on YouTube. The channel is SR Thunder Gaming.